Hi, this is an updated guide for getting Toe games to run with TH Curve patches through Steam Proton. Like last time, we'll be using Tacticon's wrapper script. A lot has changed since the last video. For example, you don't need to configure TH Curve manually anymore. And there is also a flatpak available. A link to the GitHub repo as well as all the comments you need are in the description. First of all, if you're on Arch, you can skip the manual installation and get it from the AUR instead. And it's thcrab steam proton fabric git. The long one, but yep, yeah, uh, this will install it for you, which I'm not gonna do right now. There's also the flatback, uh, but I won't be going over using the flatback version as I don't use flatbacks. But I'll install it, you can just do something like flatback install. Oops. Install flat hub com dot path software dot steam dot utility and then it's just the same thing except with underscore so thcrap underscore steam underscore proton underscore wrapper. So the manual installation will download the script from the GitHub page. So curl and there is this long URL here. Done with that, no time at all. Um, we'll mark it as executable. And then move it somewhere convenient, like let's say, hold on, let's do, put it to local bin. That's a good one to do it, a good one to move it to. Now, if we uh, try to autocomplete, there we go. If you already have an existing THCRAB installation, you can point the script to use that configuration. So if we look here, here we go. The first two things are the things you can change. So by default, it points to local share and it makes a thcrab directory in there. So if you already have thcrab installation, you can change this to point to that. You can also change the config file that's loaded by default in case you want something else than English. Now we need to set the launch options. So go to your Steam library and right click the game you want to run with patches and go down to launch options here. And the basic way to do this is just type in THR Proton dash dash and then oops, percent command percent. If you put the script outside of user logo bin or in case of the AUR package, user bin, you'll have to provide the full path. So path to GSCRAP Proton. Wherever you put it, but you know, I would just recommend putting it in user logo bin if you're installing manually. If you want to change the config loaded by THCRAP, use the C flag. For example, the Brazilian Portuguese. That will be pt-br.js. For vpatch, you can use the v flag, but I'll get to vpatch in a moment. If you want to use any environment variables in, in your launch options, you can put them before the percent command percent. For example, proton use wine e3d. But also something that I commonly use is game mode, so I can put game mode run before the command and that will work just fine. Now we just launch the game and the script will take care of everything as you will see in a moment here. Alright, so if there's no DHCRAP installation yet, you'll get this pop-up. Uh, DHCRAP doesn't appear to be installed in uh, local share DHCRAP, would you like to, this script to install there? Yes. And this it's really simplified compared to last time. It will download the HCRAP for you. It will set it up in the background. It will skip searching the games. You'll get the configuration tool. Now, what I will do is click configure and disable enable background updates when a game is running. Uh, the other settings don't really matter. Let me go next. And this is where you get to choose all the patches you want. Uh, you can go advanced 
and there's a whole lot of stuff you can get. But I simply just okay, simple. All right, here the English language pack. This will give you the EN JS and all that good stuff. And we'll do that. We'll finish. And now every time you launch the game, it will do this and install the patch for the actual game you're playing. So every time you launch a new game with this, it will download the patches for that game. Uh, there we go. That's Toho running through Proton with the H crap. Uh, as you can see, we go to the music room. Everything's working. Oh, they actually have translated this part now. Last time I played this one translated. That's cool. Oh, okay. And so are the character selection text. Excellent. And once you quit, you know, game will chill close just fine. Now for V patch, it's a little more involved because V patch doesn't work with the Steam executables. So you'll have to replace the uh, TH and then the num whatever the number is, the executable with um, with this CD version, which you know is easy to find. And then you install V patch as normal, as you can see, and we will use Mountain of Fate as example here, and we add that. B flag, and now instead of a tiny screen, as I've already configured B patch, you'll see that it will actually. Well, first of all, it will download the patch. As you can see, it's big because that's how I set it. stuff so that's how you'll get tow games to work with the hcrab with proton really simple quick and easy i'll create a tactic on as always and i hope this helped you and uh i'll see you later